Hi, welcome aboard. My name is John White, also known as Jet Aviator 7. Over the years, I've learned a lot about aviator sunglasses, and I'd like to share what I've learned about some of the various models with you today. Today, I want to talk about the various parts of an aviator sunglasses frame. The frame is, of course, the thing that holds the lenses. Now, what I am holding here in my hands is what's called the front. The front of the frame. This is a Randolph Aviator matte black front. Now this part that holds the lens is called the lens holder. This part here that goes across the top is known as the brow bar or the sweat bar and sometimes it has some decoration on it. The part that holds the two lens holders together is called the bridge. The bridge and of course these are the nose pads so they uh, hold the frame up off your nose comfortably and you can see uh, the frame is slightly curved. Now attached to that frame are what people, a lot of people call arms and the arms come basically in three styles and we call them temples. Now the first style, the most common style that you'll see is called the skull temple or the wire spatula temple the skull or the wire spatula. It goes back, curves over your ear, and goes down the back of your ear slightly at about what I would call a 75 degree angle. That would be a wire spatula or a skull temple. The next type of temple that we would uh, encounter is a bayonet temple. This is called a bayonet temple. It goes straight back over your ear. Preferred by pilots because it slips on easily under helmets. Uh, motorcyclists like them as well. You can also see that this one is curved slightly at the end to fit snug up against your head so it won't fall off if you're moving your head around. This is called a bayonet temple. The third type, which I don't have a specimen of available, but it's called a cable temple. Cable temple goes over your ear, down the back side, and comes slightly forward. And these are preferred by uh, people like uh, shooters that wear shooting glasses because they move their heads around a lot and they don't want them to fall off uh, while they're shooting. Those are the various parts of a pair of aviator sunglass frames. And I hope that you found this informative. And as always, keep your wings straight and level, Hirsch.